Hello guys, welcome back to how to get video Today, yes, Archive Nights again But today I'll be showing you guys how to get the book character ITP Bonnie So, I made sure I went around and took photos of it, so don't worry But let's just get straight into the game Alright, we're inside the game, so we gotta cl 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 click Play, of course, like, of course, like, it's the most simple to Steam. Anyway, and you have to go to FNAF 1 for this. Now, wait for it to load. Alright, just click, click play, click human. Now, you need to be child, child for this. Or to get this badge. We're going to go to the first one. So, uh, it might take a little bit for it to load and stuff. Alright. Alright, so the first one, you want to go to the kitchen. Open the door. This also works in daytime, so... So, as you went into the kitchen, go into this room. And then flip these switches. It will turn on. And then after that, you want to go over here, and then you will see that it's on. So, uh, yeah. Now, since you got the other piece done, now, uh, where's this other photo? Now, we're going to head off to the next place. So, uh, okay. You want to go down this hallway into this management room or manager. Go go behind this desk and you see this little small slot which it should show the uh, switch. Click on the switch. If it turns that, that means you got that. And now it should show up there. So now we're off to the next one. If they don't shut up. Now this one is quite easy. Go to Pirate Cove and then you find it just right there. It's pretty easy. Click on it and now you have three switches on. By the entrance, go to the bathrooms. You want to go to this bathroom right here that has more pizzas. Now you're in this bathroom. I forgot. Go to these things, then you see the switch right there. Click on it. There you go. And now that is your fourth switch. Right there. Fourth switch. Now we're on to the last five. If it opens. Alright. Now the last five is inside the uh, office, actually. Wow. Climb up to these uh, desk. Right, look, look to your left, and then you see see it right there. It's stacking pretty bad. So click that. And now your fifth one's on, which I have to turn on my graphics because now it was never this bad. So we got that done. Now we're on the fifth and final switch. What do you want? What do you want? You're not cool. Alright, now this next one. If probably you didn't notice, but it's at, at the f entrance to right here. Click on it. And look, you got all of it done. But now some now you see some ears in the eyes. Now, since it's all this one, you wanna go to uh you wanna walk up. And I think you go into the ball pit. Yeah, you go into the ball pit, he will rise up, he will grab you, he will drag you down. Making you go to the other place. Now, you, you'll be brained here, which I can draw my graphics now. Which, this is a maze. <laughs> which, this wouldn't be fun. Which you have to complete all of this, but just don't fall. I never failed. Yeah, but yeah. 
yeah, you might be confused why he spawned here and not whatever. But yes, it'll all look like this now for some reason. Like you can't even like go anywhere. But since since you got out of the ball pit, go to the entrance. And now welcome to hell. And this I don't know, I have no idea what this is, but now you gotta do all of this, which is hardcore, so don't die or something will happen, I don't know. So this this is quite easy unless you're very, unless you're very garbage at uh, hardcore. So like like me, I'm garbage at hardcore. Like I'm often bad. So uh, now you'll be past this part. Now you're on second level, I guess. You, you want to go over here. Yes, this will this will drag you back. Like look there. So you want to keep jumping, and then then make sure to get in the right spot. There you go. Be careful, cause this could mess up your jump and make you die. Keep on jumping. Now you made it. Now this is a puzzle game, which you have to follow these paths. And click and step. I mean, step on one of those stuff buttons, whatever. So this could take a while. This took like about five to seven minutes. Yes, five and seven minutes. So uh, easy, right? So after you done, after you reach to this, step on it. And then, oh my God, other path will show up. Don't worry, you won't fall off. So uh, now you just do the same thing. To the all the to all of this, which, like I said, could take a while. So uh, we're just going to skip to that part. And there we go. Now, since you got all of these, one path will show up right there. You want to go to this path or the green path, whatever. Not this one, the one over there. There you go. Now, since you made it, you want to go to this hole right here. And uh, I think you get the badge now. Yep, you go to this hole. The badge is now yours. Now, how to get this, uh... Now, how to get the variants or the animatronic? Skip through this cutscene. No one likes cutscenes. Go to play. You go to animatronic. Now since you're here, you want to click on spring trap. Spring trap, which <sighs> go to variants, and now there you go. You have the skin, which amazing skin in my in my opinion. Like I know it's old and stuff, but it's really cool. So. I don't know why my controls are like this, something happened, but like, you can do a lot of stuff with it, not, not really, but this, but, yes, this is how to get ITP screen body and Archive of Nights, thanks for watching, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.